Hello, hello, hello people and welcome to Carl is on it. So today I have got with me some stuff to basically refurbish my roof. So let's have a look at it now. So this is what it looks like. So this car's been it's over 10 years old now and I'm trying to see if I can get this. There we go. So you can see all that sort of gray faded sort of side and I'm sure the previous owner must have taken it to five pound washes. I used to take it to a five pound wash myself a few times but now I'm cleaning my own car now so I just invested in buying a, um, a pressure washer and stuff so now I can use like proper products and stuff to actually clean it properly. So basically what I'm going to do is get rid of this sort of grey sort of area. In fact the whole roof really needs to be sort of re-dyed back into black and I'll show you the kit I've got with me now. What I'm going to need to do is I'm going to basically start with wash clean the car first because it is dirty and then I've also got some convertible top cleaner. This is by Meguiar's, so you've seen Meguiar's stuff on the previous video I did. They do A1 sort of products really in terms of like cleaning cars and stuff. So that's why I got that. Also got some Meguiar's um, convertible cabriolet waterproofer. So this would essentially protect it after I finish cleaning it. So I'm gonna do that and that. Inside this box here, I've got a color dye kit by Scratch Canvas Dye by um, Scratch Doctor. Now I'll leave a link in the description where to get all these products that I'm using in order to sort of restore the color of your black roof. Um, so hopefully guys this video helps and yeah, let's get straight to it. So these are the products I've got. I've got um, a Meguiar's Convertible Top Cleaner. So what this will do, remove all the sort of dirt stains, even like mold and stuff like that. And so yeah, so that's gonna be the first thing. So I'm gonna clean that up with that. Um, and then afterwards, I'm going to use the dye from Scratch Doctor, canvas dye, and mix it with their penetrating solution. That's what they had called. I think it's two to one sort of ratio, two to one um, color boost with the dye. So do that and then rub it in with those sponges and then afterwards let it dry really. So I might just use like a hair dryer really just to sort of dry it up. I think that might be like a much quicker way. Also we got this one as well. So the sun is on my side, which is nice. And yeah, so let's get straight into it. So first of all, I gave the car a quick wash with the um, some snow foam and also washed it, rinsed it with water. Now I'm gonna now use the Meguiar's Convertible Top Cleaner and try and remove any sort of mold residue or anything like that, dirt, before we apply the dye on it. Let's get straight to it. Right, so now the roof is dry, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a vacuum and basically vacuum any sort of loose dirt, um, well not really dirt but any loose sort of pieces like um, after the microfiber tile that I use and anything else really so then I can have a nice clean surface to pretty much apply the dye on. So let's get started. Right, 
we're now on the part we've all been waiting for to actually put the die on. So, it's essentially going to be one part die and two parts of color boost. So, let's do this. The next thing to do essentially is get the sponge and essentially wrap it up in the cloth. Once I wrap it up in the cloth, I'll be using the cloth to wipe down and basically dab into the dye. So that's what I'm going to do now. Right, so here we go now. I'm going to dab some of that. So I've wrapped the sponge up inside the clean cloth. I'm going to dab that in and then we're going to get straight into this bit here. Also, it's um, paint friendly, so if it, any part, any of the um, liquid goes down in the paint, then it's pretty much okay because you, um, you can wash it off basically. So let's get started. A difference from that compared to this you just see it blending in nicely now and this is just the first coat of it so I'm gonna just continue and do the rest of the coats just see it now working so nicely the color is just coming out very well those white patches now you can't really see them anymore which is nice Anyway, we'll see the results when it dries up really, so just keep going in. We'll get into another patchy part here. This is another patchy area, so let's start applying it around here. And get the sun out, the sun glare out. Another patchy area here. It's in white. So you can virtually see the results now. It's come out so much more darker now. It's absolutely amazing compared to what it used to look like before. I'll give you a preview of what it looked like before. Right now. And this is now what it looks like now. Right, now that the um, the roof has now been drying out, what I'm going to use is the convertible and cabriolet waterproofer from Maguire's. So this would essentially seal the roof and make it much more durable now. So this is like the final step. So look at that now, it looks like brand new. Absolutely amazing. So again guys, link in the description where to get those products. Time to go straight into using this. Let's go. Well guys, that is now it really. So, quick look again. Now I've been sprayed over with the Maguire's waterproofer. 
So now it's been protected as well. So fresh, re dyed, and now protected. Looking around the roof again, and it's actually looking absolutely amazing. So we've now officially reached the end of the video now. The car roof is now completely refurbished now, so it's looking absolutely amazing and it's also protected too. So that's, I'm so happy about that really. So now the next thing I'm gonna do soon is I'm going to be doing angel lights in this car soon as well. I'm gonna get them installed. Um, also, there's quite a few stuff that I wanna get done, but I think that one's gonna be, get, that's gonna be the next priority. Um, so yes, yeah, so that one's gonna be next. But guys, thank you again for watching to the end. Hit that like and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.